Hi there everybody, Big Malcolm here, and this is my video log for Thursday, July 11th, 2013. Okay, so went to the Exploratorium today and ran around, checked out some cool exhibits. I laid in this thing, I think it was called a Utica crib. Uh, at least I think that's what it's called. And it's this kind of like coffin slash, slash cage thing. It, it was something um, mental institutions used back in the day. And basically what it is is that it, it looks like a big coffin like about a six foot eight inch long coffin, but instead of having a solid top that opens and closes, it, it, it's like I said, it's like a cage. And, you know, you can still put your hands through uh, and, and everything. And, well, I, I can't believe the shit they did to people in those uh, mental institutions. Wow. So yeah, anyway, I uh, had a good time, walked around the place, um, had a really good lunch, uh, spaghetti and Italian sausage, and oh yeah, San Francisco Giants finally won today against the uh, San Diego Padres. Thank you guys, thank you, uh, that freaking time, and... Yeah, that's basically it. Uh, nothing goofy or weird to uh, report today. Oh, and I wanted to share uh, a True Blood um, theory I have. What if war... Uh, okay, so Nora has been reading that Vampire Bible thing, and... She keeps bringing up the fact that it says that Warlow is supposed to bring uh, Lilith out into the sunlight, into the daylight. And everybody thinks that means that Warlow is going to kill Lilith. But what if instead of killing Lilith, he makes it so that vampires can come out into the daylight without getting messed up and stuff? It's just the theory. Anyway, so, uh, yeah, that's my uh, log for today. Uh, nothing else to report much. This is Big Malcolm signing off. Peace.